Hey guys, I am so excited to be here at Atlantic Health Systems with Dr. Heidinger. We're gonna be talking about the importance of hydration. Uh, Dr. Heidinger, it's so uh, great to be with you here today. Give us a little background on yourself. Uh, how'd you get to Atlantic Health? And then let's dive into hydration. Sure, yeah, I uh, grew up in Ohio, small town called Shelby, just south of Cleveland. Um, did all my training out in Ohio, went to Wittenberg University, small school in Southern Ohio. Did uh, my med school in Ohio University, then I went to university hospitals where I did my undergrad, or my, excuse me, my residency training, as well as my fellowship where we worked with the Browns and Kent State, as well as various other schools. Awesome, impressive, impressive. So obviously you worked with a lot of athletes and a lot of fitness enthusiasts. You know, this thing about hydration, it's gotten so much uh, publicity and it's so known, the importance of it out there. Um, talk to us about the importance of hydration. Can you be overhydrated? You know, what, why, what, what should people know about hydration? What are the, the top three things you think? Fair enough. Um, you know, I think it's important to realize that water is probably the most important thing we put into our bodies. Despite it not providing any caloric value, meaning no energy, yep. without water, you will die quicker than you would from loss of any other nutrient. Our bodies are made up of 55 to 60% water, muscle tissue in particular, 70% water. Mm. Water makes up a huge part of our blood volume, right? So that's gonna be important for all your nutrient uh, delivery to your muscles, as well as waste removal from all the byproducts of metabolism and exercise. Uh, in addition to that, you know, and particularly with the athlete, it's gonna be important for body temperature maintenance and sweating, right? If you don't have enough water in your system, you're not gonna be able to properly cool yourself afterwards putting you at really quite a big risk for heat illness or heat related disease. Wow, when you say it like that, it's like you gotta make sure you're drinking a lot of water, right? Uh, if anything, if you wanna focus on one thing in terms of what you're putting in your body, it's gotta be water. You got it.